every, all artists get co-signed. Like, I think that's crazy. The only thing I say would be missing is I would want to see more of our uh, legendary women in hip hop speak more on a new artist. Mm -hmm. like, I, that's something I don't, I don't see enough particularly. You know what I'm saying? Like, you think they know what's going on? Maybe, maybe they, they don't, you know. You think about like a lot, a lot of how um, those women have just, you know, expanded their careers and how busy they are. They may not. It's there's so much going on, and you know, how do you how do you find out unless you're like on blogs every day? Or, you know, you just really in tune what's happening. So I'm not I'm not for sure. I can't speak on it. I can't speak for them either. But it's just something I like to see more of. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like I always try to. Even though I'm not the biggest artist, but if I see a, a especially women, because I know the path of my heart it is doing something, I make sure I shout them out, you know, because it necessarily didn't happen for me. But you know, you being the OG that you needed, basically. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What would Queen Layla say mm -hmm. to you right now in regards to where you're at? Wow. Everything, professionally, personally, just you, the woman you become. Mm -hmm. She she would say that. You know, she was proud of me and proud that I didn't change who I was. That I'm still Marlena at the end of the day. My aunt still tell me that, you know. Um, you represent us well and we're proud of you. So I think that's just what, that's what she would say. And that's, what, that's ultimately what's gonna stand the test of time. Yeah. You've embraced the whole marathon concept from, from Nipsey. Oh, completely, completely. That's, that's one of the first things when I came in with Ninth in 2009, he said, this is gonna be a marathon. 